So we'll see this. Yeah, hello everyone. So I'm I'm the last, hopefully not not the least, right? And I'm standing between you and lunch, so I'll, I'll make it very very short. Uh, my name is Farhad Bazier. I uh, represent Physio Impulse. Uh, we are uh, a small startup based in London, UK, uh, and we are basically the the newcomers to manufacturing. Um, uh, but basically, we're trying trying to to find our fit in the sector. Um, we have worked in other sectors, however, in uh, construction, in energy, and so on. And, and the technology is very transferable. So, so we're hoping that um, you know we can make the transition. Uh, the, the particular idea that uh, I'm uh, going to, to present here is uh, basically quality assurance and quality control, uh, a model free um, uh, visual quality assurance system. Uh, that is, so uh, the idea is that if you have uh, um, a, a three-dimensional model of, of the parts uh, that, that you're manufacturing, and by model, I mean uh, just a scan, right? So if you have either cameras or laser scanners that's looking at the, at the, at the products, um, uh, we provide basically the software side of it uh, that can uh, do anomaly detection. Uh, the, uh, Maybe the unique uh, offering here is that uh, we don't need to know what, what, the, what the, the default anomaly can be. So it's very much data-driven, uh, self-supervised learning. So basically that the system learns from, from the data itself and it only needs to, to see the, uh, the, the good examples, right? So we don't even need to show it the, 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 the faulty parts. Um, we have uh, applied the, basically the same idea in, uh, like I mentioned, in a, in a slightly different uh, application. Uh, which was here the modeling uh, uh, kind of um, office scale or, or room scale uh, indoor environments. Um, uh, and uh, yeah, we could, we could identify all the anomalies. Uh, on top of that, we did some, some work with uh, uh, NPL, National Physical Lab in UK, which was basically coming up with statistical, um, uh, statistically correct uh, bounds. Uh, which basically means uh, we, we can um, uh, we, we can give the guarantee to, to the user that okay that, that this this part of the analysis we are certain and at this part we are not so that's kind of like an, uh, not only we say that uh, we, we are we managed to identify the, this sort of anomalies in your product but we also say oh there were the, this 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 areas that uh, the system was just not certain about uh, what it did so maybe then an expert can come in the loop and and complete this is uh, complete the analysis basically. Um, yeah, I, I think that that's more or less um, uh, the, the the idea. So the the, the expected impact is um, basically a cost cost effective platform uh, that that enables us to to do uh, quality assurance very quickly. Uh, it can be deployed very 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 quickly and then very. Uh, efficiently, and it can be uh, repurposed from from product to product, from um, yeah, but basically one scenario to the other without the need to, to change the software side of things at least. Um, so uh, multi-purpose, uh, very quickly deployable, and, uh, and very cost-effective. That that's how I would summarize it. Um, in terms of uh, partners, like I said, we are very newcomers. We are very small company, so we are as flexible as as it can be. Um, uh, in terms of starting date, in terms of the duration, uh, basically we are looking for for bigger partners who can lead the, the consortium and, and we can join and hopefully add, add some uh, value to, and, and bring something positive to the table. Um, yeah, thank you very much. That 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 was the one. And that's my contents. And back here, if there's any question. Okay, thank you.